Hello everyone. I've noticed some folks are having a hard time setting up a dedicated Valheim server or having their world seen or able to change the password or server name. Now this is very easy. So all you have to do is download the dedicated server. You right click, go to manage, browse local files. Then you right click on start headless server. And in Windows 11, you have to do show more options, edit. And this is what you will see. So the common issue or if you look online, you look at a, at a screenshot of how to configure this. In all the cases that I've found, it seems that they show the quotations around, for example, your world is called dedicated. This will not actually work as the quotations are around it. So if you want to put your world in here, it should be without the quotes. So my world is called world one. This will work. Now, if you have this in a, instead of that, your server will now see the world. Now, say if you want to rename it to test server, you also remove the quotations and the same with the password. And it's just strange because in most of the guides you look at, they tell you to replace what is within the center of the quotes. And if you're not familiar to any kind of coding or anything like that, you may struggle and be trying to figure out why is the server not seeing my world. And this is why it's because of the quotations. If you're not sure why, or you want to see an example, for example, see, if you look at port, this is part of the code. The uh, port is 2456. There are no quotes around it. You, same with here. If you, if you check, you can see that this is not consistent. Essentially, when you have the quotes around it, it skips this line. So at the moment, it's going just with the default server. The password is just default secret, and that, that's it. So just remove the quotes that we like, and your game should work. Hopefully, this helps someone. But yeah, just it's, it's not quite clear that. It's not supposed to be like this. And, and if you've never opened or edited a file like this or anything like that, it may seem confusing, but it, it's really quite simple. So hope, hopefully that helps.